<laughs> Eating my bun. Didn't even really drink my coffee. It's 7.31 a.m. Gorgeous out. Now I have a lot to be thankful for because I woke up late today. Oh my gosh. How does this happen? I still... I popped. Um... Anyways, I'm very grateful. I had a very blessed night. My dad is a type 1 for the moment. I'm believing he's being healed. And I know anybody might say, you're crazy. I don't care. I believe he's healed, being healed. But at this in this point in time, he's a type 1 diabetic. And he had a low reaction last night. And he has them sometimes in the night. He took a little bit too much of a shot. And I'm very grateful my sister found him. We sure are just feeding him three three things this week. We also, my mom makes energy balls like the peanut butter, the honey, the oats. So we just, we fed him. I think I have like three of those. Oh shoot, that's a lot. We started, I heard them downstairs 2.59 and it took him till 3.30 and he checked his sugar. And it was 45. So, God is very, very good. I'm very blessed that he is still here. And I'm very grateful. So, I love him. <laughs> so much. So. Um, I'm grateful for... Don't worry, I'm getting all sappy. I'm grateful for churches happening today. I am grateful. I honestly... I do love church. I would have rather... If you're asking me right now, since my dad, you know, we were up a little bit last night. We would just eat breakfast, hang out, talk. Because that is my heart. I love, love connecting that way. Just through talking. and It's my favorite thing ever. Um, But we still have church, which is okay. I know my brother and my dad love to go to the gym right when we get home from church. So at least we can have breakfast. Maybe not actually. Never mind. It's going to be a rougher day. But I'm grateful for what we have. Wow, look at this tanner. I'm going to rub that off. I'll smooth it out. But it's okay. Um, we still have to, we do have to stay at church because our family is hosting coffee hour, which is a good thing. I love to serve people. I love to help. Um... So we're gonna we have bagels and it's not very glamorous since it is Lent, but we'll have pe peanut butter, excuse me, jelly I think and cream cheese. I don't know because of the dairy thing. Because I guess you're not allowed dairy either, which I can't even eat dairy, so I'm fine with that. But there's that, so we'll be there because it's also the priest's birthday today, so we'll be at coffee hour for a while. But I'm grateful I have to remember to pack something just because I can't really eat the bagels, which is fine. Oh, I think I can eat a cake, the cake that's there, if she made it, because it's gluten-free, dairy-free, which you never hear of that. So if I get that opportunity, I will take it, and I'm grateful for that. I'm not trying to tell you guys my life story. I'm trying to be thankful, but it takes a minute to tell you to be thankful. I'm thankful that I have a clear face. I am thankful that this week coming up is going to be smooth. It's going to be a good week. Um, just a fun week. Yeah. I'm thankful that my heart is opening. And the... Um, I imagine. This is what I imagined last night. Because... I'm not going to go that deep, actually. But I'm just loving myself fully. In this moment. Healing, you know, my skin with my heart and I know also wearing a mask too but it's okay Ooh. but I'm grateful I have clear skin I'm grateful I have two boys that love me my dogs and I'm grateful for my boyfriend um my 500 followers on here that watch this and say hey I like you I'm gonna subscribe or you bring encouragement to my day I'm thankful that this is, I got so many passive weight 
passive, um, I was gonna say passive range of motion. Oh, that's physical therapy. Um, um, I have a lot of sources of passive income, but especially this one. It's just so fun. You know I'll give you my honest opinion. I just, I'm thankful that brands, uh, they send me different products and I have to try them and, oh, it's just a hassle. No, it's so fun. I'm so grateful I can do that because that's awesome. Um, cause I, you know, you guys know I give you my honest opinion, but it's just fun. And I'm grateful for God have, helping me reach millions of people. And I'll come back when I'm makeup's on and I gotta figure out what I'm wearing, but I'm grateful that I have. I'm gonna have a little chat with God, just open my heart to him. Just be real, raw, honest, and heal. <sighs> Be back. Okay, hi. So I'm grateful. Everything went well at church. My mother, my dad, my brother, my sister, we all helped out. Delicious dairy free, gluten free cake. I also had gluten free bagel with dairy free cream cheese, which was delicious, which I'm grateful for because I was just thinking I never even asked. I was like, hmm, I would like a bagel that I could be able to eat because after church is fine. But I could never really eat anything else. I had a nice, delicious cup of black Dunkin' coffee. It was good. It's really good. I have just been, and I haven't even filmed, but every little thing I've been grateful for. Just saying, oh my gosh, thank you for this. Oh my gosh, thank you for this. Just without knowing, I am becoming gratitude within my heart. And I am realizing how abundant I truly am inside. And right now, I've come to a place of just love for myself love for myself um i would say love for my family as well um yeah for sure that's easy they're easy to love, I love lo i'm loving life right now today my heart is is whole it feels whole and it feels so peaceful inside and just it just it's everything i've ever wanted out of life you know i want to wake up grateful excited about the day excited a lot can happen in a week and i know for most well if you're christian this is your easter week and orthodox or we're a week later this year but it's really cool because that can even apply to well jesus seen you know, death and resurrection but it can also apply to us i mean a lot can happen in a week anything miracles can happen your life can change hold on hold on bust I'm very grateful. Also, I finished my board studying for those those two quizzes. And I also got my goals down mostly. So we're pretty much going solid into this week. So I'm very excited. Another week. I will come back on later. Probably once I get a shower, want to. I'm just, I'm very, very blessed inside. And you are too. Well, it's ending day 30... Five, I think, hold on. Yep, yeah, it's day 35. Ending day 35 is 801. Sunday night. I'm very grateful for so much. I'm grateful that I, we still have toilet paper. Um, honestly, the day went really smooth. More than I thought. Um, I had a, I think I said it already, but the cake was delicious. I already said it. But I'm just grateful that I got to eat things at this coffee hour, and it was really fun. Um... I'm grateful for, I am just so grateful my heart is healing. What I need to tell you all is I'm grateful that as I focus on the external environment, you know, the reality around me, um, and I start to be really unfulfilled. And so then I say, okay, let's not do this anymore. Let us focus on the internal environment because what I really do want is love. Because that's what every human being wants is love. And I'm grateful that the Lord is showing me you know, through different teachings and um, audios and, and different YouTube channels. It's pretty awesome how really we need to, f I need to focus on the internal and my heart and give myself that love I need. And then everything just shifts and I don't really, the external's almost like, I want to say icing on the cake because it is. It's almost like, oh yeah, I already got it here. 
but that's lovely. I get to enjoy it there, you know? And so that's what I'm very grateful I'm learning. And I'm going to ask God to help me remind me to do this all tomorrow at my clinical because I'm starting my third week. I'm so grateful you guys are watching. I'm grateful for 500 subscribers. I'm grateful actually for a million subscribers. A million of you that watch this. Subscribe to my channel. Um, grateful for, but the thing is I say that and I'm like, yeah, that's good. You know, that's, that's good. That's fun. It's not fulfilling though in the heart. What's fulfilling is loving myself, accepting myself and just, oh my gosh, does it feel good to just breathe and rest within and, and just say, I love you. You know, then I feel like it doesn't matter what I do. Because I am loved and I am nurtured and I am safe, you know, and I am protected within because I am loved. Oh, it feels so good. Okay. See you guys all tomorrow. I'm probably just going to watch a little bit of my Chinese show. I'll let you know if it's good. Also, any recommendations on any other good, wholesome? And I don't mean like, but just not any crazy scenes. I want to keep my mind pure. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow for day 36.